You're so bad at this. No, you can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. No. I got I got I got I got. No. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Look at her. She's driving like 400 miles to Cleveland today. Hi everybody, my name is Ken Eckel. In sharp contrast to very, very snowy, we got quite a bit of snow last night. And I have to drive home today, or not home, but back to school sort of. I'm driving to Jamie's house and then in a few days after that we're driving to school. I'm just very excited to be back with her. It's been a while. Ah, I don't wanna leave home though. Always, it's always so sad. Bye. Love you, Dad. I'll see you later. Oh, and it's time. Ugh. Well, I thought I was saying goodbye. Then I sat in my car for like 20 minutes trying to stick this thing to my windshield. Turns out, and every time I tried to clean my windshield with something, Dad brought out some like Windex. Yeah. It was just freezing on the front window because it's 20 degrees. Hey, it's 20 degrees. Maybe we shouldn't try and Windex my windshield. Yeah, probably. Wouldn't. Oops. Oh my gosh, I just had the most like painful experience of my life. Just tried to fill up my gas. It is 24 degrees outside, but there is a such a strong wind, it literally was gonna kill me. But I wanted to talk about while I'm stopped and have a moment, my travel essentials for road trips. So there's a lot of things you can do to help pass the time. I have like my tips and my things that I do, so I thought I would let you know, and just my general things I use when I'm in the car. So, started off, I always have like a bottle of water. That should just be your go-to. You may have to pee often, but like, just being hydrated while driving is really good for you. Second off, this is a fun one. I always keep, wait, let me show you. I always keep a little thing of Play-Doh in my car so that whenever I'm driving, I can just take this out and in one hand, just be grabbing and playing with Play-Doh. I'm not kidding. This, this stuff's my life, right here. Boom. If you're a YouTuber and make videos, if you want to do time lapses, this little thing suction cups to your windshield. You can hold your phone, your camera, your watch, I don't know, whatever you want it to hold if you really can. Um, it's really, really helpful. And then, what number am I on? This is my favorite thing that I have. So, this thing's called Zeus. It's a little plug. There's a link in the description for it because I just genuinely wanted to tell you guys about this thing. It's a little car charger. It has two USB things, so it charges like 10 times faster than any of your other ports will, which is fabulous, meaning you can run a map on your phone and this thing will actually keep your phone charged enough to keep it going. I started the drive with 20% battery because I may have forgotten to charge my phone last night, which is the biggest mistake of my life and I'm all good now. Feels great to me. Here's one of my favorite parts about Zeus too. It actually connects to your phone. So Zeus connects to your phone, and then whenever you turn your car off, it automatically puts a GPS location where you did that, and so you always know where your car is. I think that's fun. I just like to have it so that like, if my friends are doing something with my car, I know where it is. All right, so I've gotten on the road just because I need to kind of keep it moving, um, but I wanted to tell you about my other few recommendations of like, things you should be doing while, like driving. Vlogging is not one of those things that you should be doing while driving. But I love, love, love listening to podcasts. So my podcast recommendations for anyone out there, or my podcast recommendations for you are simple. There's two that I just obsessively listen to. One is called If I Were You. It's by um, these two ex-YouTubers, I guess. They made the show Jake and Amir and they basically just give advice on these randomly hilarious situations that people are in that they email in. Um, and the second one is called Welcome to Night Vale. It's all about this town. I can't even explain it. It's just the weirdest town in the world. It's the weirdest podcast in the world, but it's absolutely hysterical. So those are my two podcast recommendations. Just give them a listen. I promise you will enjoy your time. Make sure you get 10% off. Oh my God. That's last noise, dudes. It's very snowy. 
and I can't now see a lot of things. So I'm gonna stop vlogging now. And that's my plan right there. Yep. <laughs> All right, I'm in like three hours to three hours away from Jamie's house. I've been on the same road for the past 240 miles and I have 200 more to go. Kill me! Yep. I am one minute away from, I don't know why I looked at my phone, I know where I am. One minute from Jamie's house. I'm so excited to see her again. All her roads are covered in snow though. Looks like they have the same amount of snow as we did in New Hampshire. Oh, skidding a little bit there. What are you doing? Are you a cat? She's a cat. Okay. I think I should go home now. <laughs> I'm not... This is all you came here for. I need to. I need to go home. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Boop. That's Newt. Yep. Mine. <laughs> Serious problem. Look at how many freaking Worthers I ate while I was on this trip. There's still this whole bag, but that's actually really dangerous. Yikes. Ugh, messy car. Sad face. Well, at least I'm here with Jamie, but I didn't win my Powerball numbers. I only got one match number. That's upside down. One match number. Also, I bought a lottery ticket. That was a big move today. <laughs> Did you win, Jamie? I didn't buy a ticket. Well, we won friendship. Mm -hmm. That's what we won. All right, no more swinging that pillow at me, okay? <laughs> or that water's gonna end up in your face. All right, well, thank everyone for, thanks everyone for watching. I'm watching you, okay? What? I'm not doing anything. I don't, that's just fishy right there. I'm going to bed. Jamie and I have a fun day for tomorrow. We don't know what we're gonna do yet, but it's gonna be something around Cleveland, Ohio. Mm -hmm. All right, well, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Finish that hard, follow your dreams, and I'll see you in a vlog tomorrow. <laughs> ever made that's this all right and the gap home. is right here get some food, this is you always trying to achieve this you're always trying to get here watch it it's but by doing